Hi guys, I, I am on the, the other side of the other section of this farm. Look at that. The place is so beautiful, very calm. Now those are, those are yams. No, uh, pumpkins, not, not yams. That they, they have pumpkin. They have some 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 other items here, but most of the time is spinach. They are very much based on spinach. Look at that. That's such a beautiful. Wow. Right. So I'll go this way. He told me, you can you can come this way, this direction. All right. And we have bananas here. They have bananas on the sides. I think it's, it, it acts as a fence also. Still they have spinach. I, I, love, I, I really like the system of water. Water system they have is, is simple and okay, it's like a little bit expensive, but once you, you make it, then you'll be enjoying it. See? So this system here is like the water it's pumped from the well comes here and then they release the water from here comes around that way and then they, they build some uh, paths to direct water to the they direct water to the uh, uh, spinach so basically when the water runs here then they'll open here they'll open here the water goes in there after when it is enough, they close here. It, it comes this way. They open here again. Okay, using hole, they open here. The water goes in there. They close it. And then they go on again, open there and there. All the way. Beautiful. So, uh, I don't know if it is sustainable way. But I, I know that it works well for them because you can see how far and how successful they are right now and he told me you know what we don't even go to the market the market comes to us people are standing on queue all of them they want to buy our product so this is a good thing so they're selling at a farm gate all right probably they don't they don't sell very expensive but it's the best way <laughs> Because you don't need to run to the market with your product. And this is uh, all the farmers, they have that dream, you know. So look at that one here. Me, you know, whenever I see coconut tree, I must film. Coconut tree is the most lovely tree as far as my interest in farming is. All right. And one good thing, all the residue they keep here, they keep them. So that it acts as a uh, mulch and then also it decomposes to become manure. Now look at that one here. Uh, let me show you also the, the fence they are using. You see these, these guys they are only using uh, raw material they have in, in their vicinity. Look at that one. Now this is coconut palm. This one here. They have some uh, woods going around and coconut palm. And then they they fix a fence. I, I I really love it. I love it. It's the best way to do. This is very environmental friendly. Definitely you can use chain links, but if you can have uh, raw material from the nature that decomposes after some time, and then you put new one, why not? If this fence can hold for two to three years, then it's okay. Yeah, I think basically you can just come and exchange the the palm tree and or, or you just mend it you know look at this one here wow what do you have down here passion and a little papaya okay right so this is the fence i was talking about he has spinach everywhere this is a sea of spinach and guys this tree here is uh, it is neem tree neem tree Azadiracha indica one of the magic tree that it is a must-have in your farm look at those bananas beautiful 
everything about this farm is just beautiful, man. I, I, I just have to say it the way it is. Yeah. Let, let me move. Let me just move on. Now, this is, as I've said earlier, this is where they get their seeds. See, this one is a little bit red, and that one is still green. That red one here, it is almost ready. They pluck it down, dry it, and then they replant it. I have seen another passion there that I'm going to, to pick it up. This is passion here. Wow. Now, th this will be my, my present because I, visit, I, visit, I visited this guy. I'll ask him. I'll tell you, you know, I'm taking this. He said, no, no problem. Take it. They, they were very ha happy to, to have an, uh, a guest. You know, to tell the truth, it doesn't happen that someone come early in the morning and they want to, that person want to go around. It doesn't happen more often. Guys, it's morning. It's about 7.30, 8 o'clock in the morning. It's a beautiful day. I'm just enjoying my life, guys, J to be honest. They allowed me to come in their farm, and this is the best thing you can do in the morning. So here we are. Let me go on. Wow. Remember, moving with my uh, passion. Look there. Wow. Now, in this compartment here, I will just show you the... Look at that. We have a mango and a millipede. Okay? So, when you see millipede, that means that farm does not use chemical. They say that they never use chemical. They just use uh, manure. This is... this here is where they have manure now see all the way here they keep manure until it it decomposes thoroughly then they use it in there but these people they have more manure you know they have look at that one here that is manure they they have been chopping off chopping down a mango tree to get more manure all right, and uh, I, as I was moving around, I came to realize that there are various farmers here that are pl uh, planting uh, spinach. I will just very, very briefly film here. Let me, okay, this guy doesn't have uh, spinach, but he has something. So in this region here, in this area, I came across four farmers that they are practicing this. So probably one of them started, inspired the other one, and the other one, and the other one. And I really love it. This is how we should go. Neighbors should be helping one another, inspire one another. All right? So I will continue here. Uh, this one is so lovely. That is a banana trunk. We have some dry banana leaves there. All this is manure. All this is manure. And this type of manure, organic manure, can really make your farm more sustainable. You eventually will not need no to buy uh, manure from anywhere because you have organic manure. And organic manure is the best way to, to go. This guy, he has blended everything. I really, really love it. He has blend, blended everything. I have no word for this farm. This is the most perfect farm. Right? Uh, look here. What is this? Moringa oleifera. Moringa. That we call Malunga. In Thailand, I think, or India. We call it Mzungi in my country. Beautiful. Right? That is Moringa. So this guy has basically everything that you can, you can mention. And he can change his farm whichever way he wants. He can keep birds, he can keep goats, and he'll, he'll keep on going. So guys, I'm very happy that you looked around. This is the second part of my video where I'm being uh, welcomed by this guy. They don't know me who I am. They don't know my intention. They say, you know what? If you're here to film and you want to look around, 
you should be more than welcome. Let me go here and see what they have here. This is the final thing. I'll see. Wow, look at that. So much seeds that are coming. Whoa. Now, all this is seeds, right? So they're keeping the seeds here. Look at that. So all this is seeds, right? See. So these people are self-sustainable. I think the, this is what they call sustainable agriculture, isn't it? So they have everything and they don't need to buy. They don't, they're using less input. I spoke to that guy, he said, we don't use much. We don't buy much. The seeds, we don't buy. The manure, organic manure, we have it. And you have seen, they have organic manure across here, everywhere. So this is what I'm trying to to achieve. I really want to come to that uh, level, right? So guys, thank you for looking by. Bye for now, right? Look at that, oh. And then you have the most beautiful trees in the world. Palm trees, or I mean uh, coconut trees. You see coconut trees, you have so much use of it, all right? I have done one film, one video only based on coconut. I'll make another one because I, I was talking about the benefit of coconut, but I just mentioned some few things. All right, so thank you guys. Thank you for looking by. If you have any comment, any request, any question, don't hesitate. Go down to the um, uh, comment section. Please write what you think. Just give me a reflex. I want to know what you think about uh, this film. Is there anything I can do better? Is there anything I can do so that you, you want to watch? I'll do it, man. Right? Thank you for now. Stay calm. Stay cool. Stay healthy. Bye-bye.